Hey guys, this is I Hate Panjos, and this time I'm doing a different LP. I'm not gonna do my Sims King, that was dumb. And I decided that I'm terrible at Ocarina of Time, and I thought you guys would enjoy watching me do a blind run. Oh, what fun! Alright, so I'm just gonna use. I'm just gonna call myself Dirt with Big Letters. In the vast, deep forest of Hyrule. Long have I served as the guardian spirit. I am known as the Deku Tree. The children of the forest, the Kokiri, live here with me. Yes, Kokiri has his, her, her own guardian fairy. Sorry for failing a reading there. However, there is one boy who does not have a fairy. Shudder, shudder. Eight. 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 And I apologize for the poor quality of these videos. I'm sorry. I have no. I don't have a capture card, I'm recording this on my iPhone. So I apologize for the poor quality. Eight minutes. Uh, Navi, Navi, where art thou? Come hither. Oh, Navi the fairy, listen to my words, the words of Deku Tree. Dost thou sense it? The climate of evil descending upon this realm. Malevolent forces even now are mustering to attack our land of Hyrule. For so long, the Kokiri Forest, the source of life, has stood as a barrier, deterring outsiders and maintaining the order of the world. But, before his tremendous evil power, even my powers has nothing. I apologize for that. It seems the time has come for the boy without a fairy to begin his journey. The youth whose destiny it is to lead Hyrule to the path of justice and truth. Navi, go now. Find your friend. Find a young friend and guide him to me. I do not have much time left. Fly, Navi. Fly. The fate of the forest. Nay, the world depends upon thee. Sorry for failing a reading. Alright, so this is not really a blind run like I said in the beginning. I consider more of a visually impaired run. Because I stink at Ocarina of Time. Oh, trust me, it'll get entertaining once I hit puberty. Oh, not me. I derp. The guy of the game. Eh, yeah, I apologize for rambling. Hello? Derp! Wake up! The great Deku Tree wants to talk to you! Derp! Get up! Hey, come on! Can Harvel's destiny really depend on such a lazy boy? You finally woke up. I'm Navi the Fairy. The Great Deku Tree asked me to be your partner from now on. Nice to meet you. The Great Deku Tree has summoned you. So let's get going right now. But first, I want to introduce you to the controls. Alright, so. I'm playing this on the Virtual Console version, so the control stick for any of you on 64 players. And virtual console players and possibly GameCube players and 3D players. Control stick is to run. You can use the um C stick and an Ocarina of Time to select your item and it's also a little cool trick I found out playing this once. If say you're hold 
anything, um, you hold, say you have an item and you equip it to, say, the right C button, you can press X to select it. Actually, that's kind of useful to say. So, without further ado, let's read this ooh thing. Read all the things! Nope, I can't read that yet. And close up of the face. And now? And now we leave. Let's go carry forest. Yahoo! Hi, derp! I was saying like that the whole time. I know. You can just you don't have to see guys just backflip off and you'll be fine. And also something interesting I found. If you go over here, press the C up button. I found a picture of a guy with a sword and a shield hiding a dinosaur. I guess foreshadowed that Super Smash Bros. and Melee a bit. I don't have to talk to Saria, but we're just gonna, cause we're gonna waste time. Wow, a fairy! Finally, a fairy came to you, derp! Wow, that's great news, I'm so happy for you. Now you're a true Kokiri, derp! Is that right? The Great Deku Tree has summoned you. It's quite an honor to talk to the Great Deku Tree. It's not red. However, if you're here, get going, go see the Great Deku Tree. Alright. The Great Deku Tree has summoned you. Please come with me. Yes, I'm gonna. I just said it like that because I hate Navi so much. Like the first time I played this game, I swear to God, I wanted to kill her. And so we could go in there first, but I think we're gonna like take a little detour. Okay, I'm gonna teach. <laughs> Alright, so if I remember correctly, you need like 40 or so rupees. The last time I played this was like last night. Like exactly 12 hours ago. I love it. Hi, derp! Look this way. Look over here with Z. And talk to me with A. Well, in my case, since I'm in the virtual console, I would press L. No, I'm not holding it. I don't have that on. I speak. Yes, yes, that's how you use a fairy. It's so great that you finally have a fairy partner. I'll teach you how to talk to people using a fairy. When a fairy flies near a person or this thing, or thing, press Z to look in that direction. If you use Z targeting, you can talk to people from a distance, like we're doing now. When you have nothing that you can target, you can just press C Z to look forward. Try it. Alright, so you go in here, let's talk to this guy. Oh. Yeah, it's 40 rupees, that was right. My memory is terrible. It's a cool little trick to get infinite money. Because the game registers your character as like... Oh, <coughs> I apologize for that. Not feeling five stars today. So you're gonna want to leave this chest. It's a recovery card. But go nuts on the other chests. Okay, so I think we're gonna end things off here. All right, so next time on Legend of Zelda: Ocarina of Time, blind run. We are going to continue on our way to buy the Deku Shield and find the sword. Okay, see you guys then.